Hey guys, welcome back to Clash Clinic. This is RJ here. It's been a little while since I've done a video, but I might start getting back into it. Um, this video today is going to be on our Sticks and Ball esports team in our CWL esports war. This is the last game. This was the last match of the season. We beat. We took down uh, Noble Nines to advance to the playoffs. We won twelve to ten, but we actually had three triples because we had a one star. Um. I'm going to go start this off showing my, my attack. I'll break it down for you, and then we'll show the other two triples. So I, on this one, I play in Queen Charge Hybrid. I see that you can get to this Town Hall pretty easily, create good pathing for your the hybrid as well. What I do like is this open space right here is like a self-funnel, which makes it even like a deep funnel. So I'm going to put a baby dragon, a loon and a baby dragon right here. I'm going to take out these three collectors. And that makes this entire thing a big open area. Keep my queen charging in. The queen's going to, and I'm going to funnel, I'm going to put a wizard over here to funnel these three buildings. <clears throat> and that opens up my queen charge right here. So I got a nice little narrow path for the queen to go through. I'm going to wall break here, then I'm going to wall break here. I'm going to wait till the queen takes down this BK platform so there's no need to break here. And then I'm going to wait till she gets down this air defense, and then I'm going to drop that wall breaker so it breaks it here. I want my queen to come in and then down this alleyway. She's gonna When she comes into here, she's going to get step up right here and take out this town hall. The CC's going to come out, so to take the CC down. But she's going she's gonna to be responsible for, let's say, something like this. She might not get that CC. She might get it, but something like that. I'm going to have two free, I have the two freezes that I can drop right here. Freeze that single Inferno. Freeze that Satter for my hybrid. Same time. Value should be great there. And then on this other side, I'm going to put my BK... Over here to go this way. He's going to clear that outside trash for the hybrid. The siege barracks is going to go right here. And that's going to funnel my my king so that he definitely goes this way. And then I'm going to bring in... Uh, so it's going to be, let's see. All of that's going to be taken out by the king. And then my hybrid is going to come in right here. The hogs from the siege barracks are going to come with them. And then that's that narrow path. It'll probably, there's probably Teslas right here, but that's still, even that right there is a super narrow path. I can place a heel here over top the bomb tower and for those scatter shots. To put the warden ability right around there too. And then my second heel will be back here. That's it. Let's see how it goes. Alright, get the queen down so that that mortar and that archer tower are tanked. Got my two wizards on the left side, my loons and the baby dragon on the top side. Loons test for Sam's, also distract the RC so my queen can take her down pretty quickly without worrying about having to use up a freeze or anything extra for those two heroes. Final set. So look how nicely this whole portion's gone this whole side is empty she has nowhere to go but in got my two wall breaks done easy with those super wall breakers there's those are amazing <clears throat> now the second this air defense goes down i will drop my super wall my last super wall break get that wall break open which it does Poison about halfway through the hound, so the, it gets the helps with the hound and then can take out all the pups. Queen's can take out the town hall. And then she's got smooth sailing from there. You can get the, uh, got my king and my BK started up top. <coughs> P 
Pekka does good for funneling the king over to the right so that the king goes down the pet down the alleyway. So now I'm dropping the hybrid. Queen's working down the left side. King's up on the right side. Hybrid's going to come in. You get that first heel down. Try and overlap as much of that as I can. Cover them giant bombs in that bomb tower. Warden ability. The siege barracks hogs are coming in. So now, timing wise, right here, it actually worked out to be perfect. The I'm a freeze at the value of that single and that scatter. Right as my hybrid is coming into range of this scatter shot. So it worked out real well that they both hit at the same time. So I got double value on that freeze spell. And I'll freeze it again right after it opens back up. Scatter got one shot off. But I got the freeze down to help keep my hogs alive through that tornado. And the queen's going to be able to take out that single inferno. Keep going. Look at the king. King's still alive. He went all the way around the base. Hybrid push right through. Didn't even need the queen's ability. Which was wrecked. Alright. Let's check out our next one. Let's see what JG's coming in here with. He's got the Yeti Smash with the jump and quad quake. So I'm guessing he's going to jump. I think he jumps here. And then he's going to quake this area. Gets pretty good value for this quake. So he's warden walking on the left side. He wants that air defense Tesla down. Probably get. Hopefully get air defense, test them, maybe cannon. So that none of his troops, he don't want those troops to run this way. He wants them to go straight in. And he put the king on the right side. I think he puts his siege barracks over here to work clearing this. Clearing this right side, sorry about that. And then help the hogs from the siege barracks. going to come out with the RC up this way too to clear that side of the base. So he got a good fun on the left side. With the warden. There's the siege barracks. Down here in the bottom. Pack is actually going to go in with the main push, I believe. Got his jump down. Uses warden ability. Perfectly timed. Tanks through the scatter shot. Tanks through the eagle rounds. Is tanking some of that uh, town hall damage. Queen took a little detour to the right, which kind of hurt on the town hall. She could have been over there and it would have taken out the town hall a little faster. Tornado right in the middle. Kind of stalling his troops up, but he's still got a really good push right through the middle. Then he's got his hogs. Out of that siege bricks, puts the RC behind them. He's going to heal them up right here. That heal is going to heal some of the, Mar the Yetis, I believe, as well, which is good. Queen has her ability, and the healers are kind of spread out. The healers are healing some of the hogs, some of the Yetis, and the Queen. Still has Queen ability, still has RC ability, still has some cleanup troops in the bag too. Healers stuck back there healing a couple Yetis. But now you only got five, def five defenses left in the RC's ability, so he pops the Queen ability. Should pop the RC ability and take out those defenses. Times to it. Oh, now he pops the RC ability for cleanup and still has what four Yetis left out of seven. Pretty smoked. All right, our last attack is by Captain Captain America. He's going to come in with the Yeti smash as well. So he's going to warden walk up here on this top right side. 
I think his main goal here is just to get a couple of this, maybe this Tesla mortar down. So none of his, he don't want those troops running this way. That would be bad. If these are down, they can go right in. Check is in his comp. He's got one super wall breaker. He's going to break open this wall. And then be able to jump here and here. With that jump and this jump, he gains access to the entire base. Just with two jumps in that wall breaker. He's using the siege barracks to funnel that left side. Getting his yetis and brought an ice golem in front of him. Go with him. Hogs are coming out. This hogs came out a little early, which isn't a bad thing. At least the town hall is not activated, so they're going to actually work right past, past that and kind of keep our, his troops from going out and around the town hall. Warden ability through the scatter and the eagle rounds. Town hall is just now activated. Queen's going to take it down. He's getting his RC in here. She's going to do pretty good work over here. Get all these outside buildings. That the main push couldn't get, couldn't reach. Freezes a scatter. I think he saved, was saving a freeze in case he wanted to freeze this single for that RC, but that scatter is pretty important to freeze there. Queen still has her ability. RC is still up. She's stuck on some skellies. King's up. Warden's still up. Has Yeti. Has a bunch of his cleanups down. Another base crushed. Times two, four. Swag does ability. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. If you like like it, give it a like. Comment down below if you want me to do some more videos. Maybe comment with tax strategy you might want me to showcase or anything like that. All right, have a good day. Thanks.